Let's be real. She see money all around me. I look like I'm the man. I think we're good. Thank you. Did they explain the sauce? She did. Thank you. So this one's the Henderson. We got like different ones. I don't know if you guys can hear me. This one's the Henderson. We got Hama Hama. And then we have two indigo. I got different, I don't know if they can hear me, different oysters. I think I'm gonna try this one first though. I actually want hot sauce. Oh, is this hot sauce? I'm gonna, it's okay, I can do it with that. That's above my palate. That one's above a little saltier. That one's a little saltier. Shoot. I have one more oyster to go. Thank you, babe. Ooh. <laughs> done with the oysters they give you hot towels I have one more oyster to go it's the big one y'all so I ordered like four different kinds yeah I ordered four different kinds I got like one of each and then two of like another kind y'all I cannot I don't know like what the mind block is but I can't even like so I've been putting this sauce on it. Cajun powder garlic sauce. It's really good. Thank you. Um, I've been using that as like hot sauce, but y'all, look at, I can't, I just, I don't know. What. So I ate all of these. Are so good, and now I'm just like, Oof. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Like, first of all, that's a lemon seed. I just need to pour some hot sauce on it, and I'll be good. I'm gonna do it now. I'm 
mixing all kind of flavors in there. Golly, you nervous. Hey guys welcome back i feel like it's been so long i feel like i don't even know where i left off i want to say my last video was the 500 subscribers um so i just want to say thank you guys again for getting me to that goal of reaching 500 subscribers next <coughs> next we are on the road to a thousand um so the person that did win her name is nisi i'm going to leave her like um youtube handle right here i gave her the choice between like target or sephora because i know a lot of people 
really don't shop at Sephora like that. So um, she ended up picking Target. So I sent her the $50 gift card to Target. So congratulations again to Nisi for winning. And thank you guys so much for all of the love and support you guys have given me thus far. Like I literally can't thank you guys enough. Like I'm still responding to comments um, on old videos and I just really do appreciate it. So I just wanted to take that time to say thank you guys. Um, as you guys can tell, I've been very sick. So it's been like a crazy two weeks since I picked up the camera. This video, this um, like footage may go at the end of another video, um, but I was literally on <laughs> my deathbed. I know I kind of sound sick right now, but I don't, I think it's allergies. I don't even know. I didn't even know you could develop allergies at this big age that I am, but I, I guess you can. Um, the background noise, of course, is washing machine. I'm literally washing every day. No, but I was literally on my deathbed. So like, I'm just starting to like clean up and eat and cook. So honestly, I would tell you guys what happened, but the doctors don't even know <laughs> what was going on. So I thought two weeks ago, I thought I had a, um, I thought I had food poisoning. So I'm like, what the heck? Like, I know food poisoning doesn't kick in right away, but I woke up that morning like puking and I'm like, what is going on? So I'm like, okay, it's food poisoning. Like I ate something bad. I'm gonna let my stomach take, it, takes it, take its course. But I also do know that I have a sensitive stomach. So I'm like asking people that day that was like eating the same thing as me, like, did your stomach hurt? Did your stomach hurt? I thought it was alcohol poisoning because I went to Disneyland that day. So everyone else was okay. So I'm like, I don't know what's going on. So long story short, my stomach started cramping. I had to go to the ER. They ended up keeping me. They were running tests and this and that, and they still really don't know, but they just put me on like three different antibiotics. They sent me home with like five medications. So um, needless to say, I'm feeling much better now. My pain was like a 10 out of 10. Now it's like one-ish. So my pain, pain is almost completely gone. I don't know what that was. They, they were even like, this is not food poisoning. Like what is going on? So I have to go again in a couple of days for a follow-up. So fingers crossed everything is okay don't know what's wrong it's scary sometimes when like doctors are like yeah we don't know you know like they don't know what's going on it's like if you don't know then um how are you gonna treat me you know it is kind of like a little scary but um I didn't eat for like a week and a half I feel like I lost like 10 pounds I think I'm being over exaggerating but like all my jeans don't fit like snug anymore like what is going on but um Anyways, I'm finally getting my appetite back. I finally cooked, like made a dinner and had a whole meal instead of like soups the, for the first time, like two days ago. And then I developed this cough and like sneeze. And I don't know if it's allergies or like the season's changing, the weather's changing. I have no idea. But this is you guys' as a reminder to make sure you guys take your elderberry, make sure you take your vitamins, make sure you're taking your greens, like keep your system, your immune system, very healthy and I do that so I'm just like I don't know how my immune system got so weak and attacked like that because I'm like I do keep up with like my vitamins my health and wellness I'm actually gonna show you guys the greens that the new greens that I started taking um, in the morning in the morning so these are greens powder it's, it's like a powder substance so I put it in my um, my little shaker if you have like a like a tiny little blender bottle it doesn't matter the size but you only um it says that you need eight ounces of water so luckily this has a measuring i don't know if you guys can see it but it has like a little measuring mechanism system right here so you just measure so you just measure um oh that got bright so you just measure eight pour eight ounces of water in here and then you're just going to get one scoop this brand is nutrition works and i'm pretty sure you can get this anywhere but it's just a little powder so then i already drank mine for this morning i'm not missing a morning now and then you're just going to pour like one scoop into your water so i've been doing that and then along with drinking lots and lots of water along with like drinking all that water i put these wellness booster they're like little drops um you guys can see I'm like putting that, um, I'm like putting that and elderberry drops in my water because 
yeah, I don't know what's going on. My washer is getting loud, so I'll come back on camera later. Okay, I just came to the other room because I'm like, maybe this will help the washing machine be going crazy sometimes. But yeah, so that's like the little update on me. Luckily, I had my wonderful boyfriend to help take care of me and feed me. Um, so that was a blessing for sure. Um, yeah, so I'm like getting my life back together doing laundry. I literally couldn't even pick up the camera. Like every time I thought about it, I was crying. You guys, I have never been in like that much pain before it's like crazy mind you like i don't know if this is tmi but like when that time of the month comes it's very painful for me like especially when i was younger like i wouldn't go to school sometimes because that's how painful it is so i know i have a high pain tolerance but when i was popping 800 ibuprofen and i was still in pain i was like oh no like i literally was taking like multiple 800 not at the same time but during the same day like two or three 800 ibuprofen and it wasn't doing anything and i was like crouched over listen to your body your body will tell you what's going on i don't know if it was fighting an infection i don't know what's going on but make sure you guys listen to your body if something feels off if something doesn't feel right always go to the doctor better safe than sorry i was like you know what i'm not gonna go i'm gonna just call and schedule an appointment in about a week no i called they were like go to the nearest er right now so i'm so glad i did i feel so much better um yeah like i said i didn't eat or anything so this morning i'm just kind of straightening up and i was gonna make breakfast because i've just been doing like the greens or like maybe a smoothie for breakfast but like i'm actually getting my appetite back which is good so hopefully i can gain a little bit more weight back um because i do feel a little a little thinner but nothing wrong with that um i probably needed my body probably needed to detox anyway but i'm just gonna make some bacon and some pancakes i already did laundry i cleaned i was spared y'all that because i'm like they don't want to see me cleaning or whatever anymore <laughs> if y'all want to see that go check out my i'll put it right here my little cleaning um vlog to give you all that motivation <laughs> but um yeah other than that i guess i'll just kind of vlog a little for today um before this will probably be disneyland and then before that i don't even know did i already show house hunting i think i showed house hunting i'm gonna get it back together you guys i'm so sorry um yeah it was just a mess but i'm alive i'm here i need my hair done desperately i don't know it looks like a mop right now i don't know what's going on um yeah so let's go make breakfast i only want a little bit of pancakes so usually i use a big bowl but i'm gonna use a small bowl today i literally just want like one or two i'm probably only gonna eat one i have not had an appetite and when i do eat now i'm like full off two bites i made a salad last night and i didn't even eat half so i'm trying to eat more and i'm actually also still on my antibiotics like i said they gave me like three so i have like two more days of taking them um but i ran out of my nausea medicine so i don't want to take the antibiotics without eating because it'll obviously make me like nauseous more nauseous so i'm like let me hurry up and eat so that i can take it and actually put a nice meal on my stomach and not just you know eat some celery let me show i have literally been eating celery carrots let me show you uh, the trader joe's chicken noodle soup this isn't even open i got it and was like i don't want to eat it too much like what and then celery i have like three of two of these in the fridge just nothing i've been eating nothing so i'm finally hungry and i've been drinking a lot of kombucha and like soda water or sparkling water so this one from Tra trader joe's lemon they have a big one but then i found that they had so the big one is like 99 cent but you know once you open it it doesn't like it gets flat quick because it's you know like like a soda or whatever um so if you keep opening and closing the big one i never finished the big one in a day so i found these small ones for for like two dollars i think or like 180 or something like that so this was much better um getting these smaller ones so if you guys drink sparkling soda, I suggest you get the smaller bottles and then bottles as well instead of cans because you can re-tighten the top one and put it back in the fridge and then when you open it again, it'll still, you know, make that noise. <laughs> Shorty a goodie, my cousins are crazy.
crazy, my cousin's like boogie Life is amazing, it is what it should be Been here for ten, but I feel like a rookie I tell her, look up, cause it's snowing in tussies Booked for three years, man, you can't even book me It's me and little baby, the going crazy Weezy produced it, and Weezy have made me And she held it down, so she got a Mercedes Your money records, the army, the navy It ran me ten thousand, I threw it like Brady The foreign is yellow, like Tracy and Katie I trust in my n they never betray me Met all these they sweeter than Sadie When I started out, I just took what they gave me Did all the favors, they never repaid me It worked in my favor, cause nobody said Brand new whip, got no keys Tell them I close, no starch, please Soon as I, you can go, leave Got M's in the bank, like yes, indeed Cardio glasses, I won't even Pikachu Yellow Ferrari like Pikachu I got him waiting and watching what he gon' do Tryna pee what I do, tryna steal my moves 2500 for a new pair of tennis shoes The same price It's like a man of youngest come and finish you Though you being charged, he'll do it like a guru Real dope boy, hundred thousand in his visa President's a ten slide by, we don't see you I been getting money, I ain't worried about what he do I'm getting money like off from the 80s Man, Dre about to drop, man, they gon' go crazy They know I'm the truth, come and spray from the basement I'm spray as a squeak, man, I'm caught from the pavement Put me in all hundreds, it man, they gon' go crazy Wham, 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 from the baby Brand new whip, got no keys Tell them I close, no stocks, please Soon as I, you can go, please Got M's in the bank, like, yes, indeed Me and my dog going all the way When you living like this, they support the head Brand new whip, got no keys Tell them I close, no stocks, please Soon as I, you can go, please Got M's in the bank, like, yes, indeed Me and my dog going all the way When you living like this, they support the head Also, um, I wanted to show you guys that I brought my boyfriend some flowers. He literally buys me flowers like every week, sometimes twice a week. Um, so for him taking care of me and just like being there, you know, the whole time I was sick and everything, I just wanted to show my appreciation for him by getting him these flowers. He was completely caught off guard y'all like he was like for me he thought i was just buying more flowers for the house i'm like no these are for you they're so pretty too i picked some great ones he was like i don't know what to do with them i'm like put them in water like where do you want to put them you know so he chose to put them here in the bedroom um i'm watching true crime daily <laughs> crime watch i love this um it's like a spinoff from um true crime i think Anyways, back to the flowers. Yes, he absolutely loved them. So yeah, this is your sign to buy your man some flowers, girl. I still have no voice, but today is my first day back in the gym after two weeks of just being sick and not coming, so I definitely don't want to push it. Um, I did about a mile and a half, almost two miles actually, on the treadmill, and then I just did some arms and some legs. Not really trying to focus on anything specific today, 
but definitely trying to get some movement in. Since I was not feeling well for so long, I just felt so icky and not really myself. Um, I really don't have fitness goals like that. I just wanna stay toned and in shape and just get some movement in my body. So I think I'm gonna call it a wrap. I've been in here for about an hour now and I'm getting tired. I still have a cough, so I definitely don't wanna push myself too much. Um, so yeah, I'll probably just get some stretch. And then after the stretching, I'll probably call it a night. I did get some squats in too. Um, I like stretching on this bar because it's kind of like a ballerina bar, but I like to like put my arms on it and lean and then like put my legs, but I'll show you guys all that um, right now. But um, yeah, back in the gym. Summer's gonna get whatever body it gets this summer because listen, listen. my camera had this mode like this little cinematic thing this is crazy it's like following me but anyways i think i'm going to go ahead and just wrap this vlog up here thank you guys again for 500 subscribers i know i keep saying that but now we are on the road to a thousand so yeah give this video a thumbs up if you guys like this video and i'll catch you guys in my next video bye she see money all around me I look like I'm the man